So, hi everyone. I'm, I've just come outside with the dogs and I got a request for a whistle training video, in particular with the puppies, but um, the big dogs are with me and it won't make much difference to your video. Um, I don't know, the pod's gone. Should we whistle train you, Edward? <laughs> and you, Alice? <laughs> You naughty. Where's your brother gone at? Lil, come on. So, what do you need for whistle training? I've got cheese. This inner tube that you squeeze out. They can just lick off the tip. And I got my Acme whistle. It's a 211 and a half. Doesn't matter what whistle you use, as long as it's the same one each time. Um, I'm just gonna find Podrick and then I'll resume the video. So yeah, anyway, back to the video. Uh, the reason I chose the squeezy cheese instead of like treats in either a bag or my treat pouch was because it doesn't make a noise. So if I go and put my uh, hand in my hoodie pouch, I'm not rustling a packet or if I undo the zip on my treat pouch, you know, it's making a noise. And then I don't want, I want them to listen to the whistle for, to come, not come because they heard the bag open, you know? So we're gonna head into the field to whistle train them. Of course, they are coming behind me. And the other thing I sometimes do is I just hold the whistle in my mouth. So like they don't see the action of me on the whistle in my mouth and come. I want them to come to the actual noise. Um, and then the other important thing is to use the same pattern of whistles. So if I just do like a long short or a long blast on the whistle, that's not what I normally use to come. So some may come, some may not. I'll show you now. See how they kind of look in, a little bit confused because that's not what I use to come get them to come. So I normally go Oh god dad God dad Got Nala Got Aria Got Ford and Got Jude Oh my god Edward <laughs> I don't know where Lily's gone um, So yeah using the same pattern Every time you whistle is important as well. Uh, yeah, I'm putting the cheese away now. You all know I've got it. <laughs> um, so yeah, they're not, um, you're not confusing them. So it's really important, particularly like if there's more than one person who takes them for a walk, that you're all in um, agreement on how you whistle into the dogs or the pattern of your whistle, whatever you want to call it. But basically, different patterns can mean different things to gun dogs. So sometimes, or sheep dogs even, a certain blast on the whistle will mean turn left, turn right, anti-clockwise, clockwise, whatever. Um, so, yeah, um, we'll try it again. Good guys. They're all working their way in. It's probably not the fairest time to do it because they only just come out. So you probably all need the toilet and stuff. <laughs> Is that nice? <laughs> oh, we've got Edward wanting to come as well, look. <laughs> I wonder if Ed would like squeezy cheese. Probably give it a go. No, not for you. Right, all gone. It hasn't really. All gone. As you can see, once they know you've got food, they're a bit harder to get rid of. 
and you want to get rid of them to keep doing the training. So this is a big field, as you can see, but it is an enclosed field. So like start in your house, in your living room, in your garden, somewhere calm and quiet. And every time they come, they get the treat. Every time they come, they get the treat. Eventually, you know, you can phase treats out and not every time or whatever, but for a long time, treats, 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 treats. <laughs> Pod's like, mm, I like squeezy cheese. It's the first time the puppies have had squeezy cheese. Oh, Aria's looking like she may want the toilet. That sort of slightly hunched back, sniffing the ground. And they kind of have the poo walk, which I know sounds a bit silly, but there you go. <laughs> so obviously as well, when they go into the toilet, don't bother. Um recalling them because it's not fair they go into the toilet they're probably not going to come Edward you're off your head bud and they love this field to play in and wrestle in because it's quite like soft and tufty Guys, you see how quick they came in then? Ah, <laughs> Jude! Put it all deep in the mouth. And Dad's was further out because he was going to the toilet, but he's coming in. You got boy dubbers? Yeah, um, you can also put the squeezy cheese in um, Kongs as well. Just like it is fattening, so it's not so good for you lot. But yeah, we did go up the tips all the way up there earlier, but not with the puppies because it's too far for them. Um, and yesterday I was working on trick dog training with um, Cal. Uh -uh, leave him. Good. Pod? Good boy. Um, yeah, we're working on trick dog training. There's like an online course, with like a list of tricks, how to do it. It's all free. Um, but then if you want to be assessed and then get like a certificate and rosettes and stuff like that, then you pay. But the actual training, what to train, everything like that is free. So I was doing that yesterday with Jude. Um, I think we've got enough tricks or behaviors or whatever um for um yeah the novice sorry the message just came through um so yeah we got enough for that so we'll probably give that another go and keep playing around with that um some of it's really just like basic obedience sit down stay come um Walk on a loose lead. You know, stuff that, you know, to be fair, most dogs do know. Um, that's right, now the puppies are wandering a bit. Watch their reaction. Good kill, Aria! Well done! I don't think it counts as a recall from you three, because you didn't come from anywhere. You were right behind me. <laughs> Um, so yeah, this is just like how we whistle train. Pod didn't come, so Pod doesn't get treat. Pod! Podrick! So he came then to his name. So he gets some for coming come to his name. You know, the point of the exercise is he comes to the whistle. He isn't, but anyway. Yeah, so I hope you all enjoy and maybe I'll upload a trick video with Cal at some point. And I shall see everybody soon. So bye. So Coming to a different field. I know I signed off on the last video, but um, anyway, I'm back now. See, they're just doing their thing. Disney seen me pick up the whistle, but.
So yeah, they're doing well. Um, sorry, I had to whistle in my teeth. Oh God, Nala's coming. Look like how far she was recalling from. So yeah, she was the other end of this field. That's why the whistle's good, because they listen from a distance. Yeah. Not done eat the whole thing, Jude. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, we're doing well and I'll see you all soon.